Hi guys and welcome to my channel. In this video, I'm going to discuss about Windows famous error, which is blue screen of death, also known as blue screen stop error or system crash. Will always happen after a critical error, error occurs, which system is not able to handle and resolve automatically. You'll experience a blue screen error during the upgrade process of Windows 10, during startup, or randomly when actively using your laptop or desktop. The most frustrating part of all is that you'll only see a solid background and a set character face without enough valuable information, the real cause of the problem. The screen will output a hint message such as your PC ran into a problem and needs to restart. We're just collecting some error info and then we'll restart for you. There are many factors which can play a role. It's almost always a problem with the quality or feature update for Windows 10. Recently installed driver, incompatible application or a hardware related issue. Ok guys, in this Windows 10 guide, I will walk you through the commands uh, which we are going to put in the command prompt of Windows 10 to restore Windows 10 or to repair Windows 10 files. Ok guys, first we need to open the command prompt. We will type cmd and guys. Uh, it's depend on what version of windows you have because over here in our example the command we search for command prompt so when you move the cursor to command prompt it will automatically give you give you the options uh, you want to open as administrator or you want to open as as a normal command prompt for our purpose because we are going to repair the file system uh, and repair the corrupt files uh, so we need to open the command prompt with the administrator access or with the administrator privileges. So in, in our case, uh, we right click and we can click run as administrator. Yes, we do. Then guys, we will use the command SFC. SFC, which is a system file checker, is a command line utility that can scan for corruptions in Windows system files and protected system files with a known good version. When you feel buggy with your computer or notice uh, problems during boot or slowness uh, in uh, running of Windows, you can use SFC to diagnose the problems and repair it. Now we will write the command. The process started. Okay guys, I'm going to pause the video because it's gonna take uh, some time and I will resume the video once it's done. Okay guys, as you can see now, there are no errors or corruption of files can be found and verification is 100% complete. But what if uh, the SFC cannot repair a file and give you the message that there are some corrupted files but unable to repair them. In that case, we will go for method number two. We will use DISM. DISM command Windows 10 can be used to repair and prepare Windows images, including Windows Setup, Windows Recovery Environment, and Windows PE. 
Also, DISM can be used to fix the recovery image within an installation of the operating system. To check whether there is any corruption, run the command line as administrator, then type the syntax and press enter. As you can see guys, no component store corruption detected. So now to scan the windows image for any corruption, we will type this command and hit enter. As you can see guys, the health checking process started. Okay guys, I am going to pause the video because it will take couple of minutes. So I will resume back once it's done. As you can see the process is completed and is showing that the component store is repairable. So it found some corruption is there. So now we are going to restore the windows image. And we will type the command and press enter. Okay guys, uh, as you can see here, we received an error. There is not enough space on the disk. By the way, this is my virtual machine. This is not my actual machine. So because uh, there is not enough uh, storage space available, so the command are not able to process. But this is the same command. If you try it, it will resolve the issue and then you have to restart the windows. Most of the time, guys, uh, this command line restoration works and it restores the corrupted file system, it will restore the windows and after running all these commands, if still you are receiving the blue screen uh, error, then it means that uh, you need to check maybe there is a hard drive uh, inside the laptop uh, is loose or uh, the RAM from the socket is loose so, so you need to check that because of those uh, hardware loose from the socket 
will also cause this kind of error okay guys uh, thank you for watching this video and i will see you in the next video take care and bye bye